What's going on everybody? DJ Goham here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Mercury Farms. Today we got a whole lot going on. We are finishing up our bales. I had to get a new bill for it because it kept falling off. So, oh, I am not on that straight at all, am I? Let's get back on here straight. I've noticed when you get up close to bales, they start freaking out a bit. They're like, oh, I don't, I don't want to go. You can't make me. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Bells are freaking out. Bells are freaking out. We've got a freak out going on. No, no, don't freak out. Just st <laughs> go where I want you to. Goodness gracious. We've got that. We need to buy some new tractors. That's right. We've got to buy two brand new tractors. Why do we have to buy two brand new tractors? Well, we got to buy two brand new tractors because we have bought some new land. That's right. But we didn't buy it here. Nope. We bought land in America. On Woodshire is the name of the farm. There we go. Oh, come on. Just get off of there. Step. Come on. Arr. This sucks. <laughs> Here's all the square bells that we've done, by the way. Also, I've uh, started this in a second day because it took so long to do the first day. So what I decided to do was leave it and see what happened. Guess what happened? It stayed. That's right. So if you guys are using the new Anderson DLC equipment and you're using the uh, Hybrid X Extractor like I am, well, you don't have to save it. You don't have to stop. Well, you do have to save, but you don't have to like finish it whenever you go in like you normally would if you were wrapping another bale with a regular bale wrapper. It just opened up like this when I came back in and I just started, you know, putting bales up there, setting bales up there and it worked perfect awesome so let's get this done let's finish getting these bales done and then we're gonna come through auto load these sell them here we go with the last bale the very last bale see what we can do by getting it in there without it freaking out come on you can do it yeah boom boom let's get this out of the way because we're gonna have to roll through and let's turn our help window on there. Pow! So we have clicked unload, and it is unloading for us. Look at that. That's just something else. All those bales. Every single one of these. I can't even believe it. Look how many bales we did. This took a long time. Gotta tell you what. It's cool. But man, did it take a long time. But the great thing now is well it's done it's completely finished up boom 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 roll through get these done now these are smaller you're probably thinking to yourself dj got an idea they look smaller that's my idea your idea is correct these are smaller than well any other uh, square bell on here and it's not a problem it is what it is nonetheless they still load up perfectly fine we are going to be using the adorante pack because we can put i believe it's, it's a 16 24 i think it is something like that i think we can do 24 square bales at one time boom all done so we'll do that let's get this taken away this can go back let's see what have we leased so the adorante pack definitely there we go let's get rid of that take this back to the main farm and get auto loading baby yeah yeah now, the Adirante pack is updated. So let's see if uh, anything has changed for us. Bell's not supported. What? Yo! They can't pick up these bells. That stinks. What happened? Did I, have the, did I have the right one? I've got to have the right one. Let's see, garage. Oh, that's round bells. What? What? Return. Return, please. <laughs> what did I do? There we go. Now let's go back into tools, bailing technology. Here I am talking all this smack, and it's like, <laughs> gotcha. Yeah, all right. Michelin's, uh, yeah, let's go. Eh, Michelin's, Michelin's look good. Let's lease it. Oh, let's go pick it up. So note to self, anytime you're using an auto load bail picker upper, make sure you can pick up the right kind of bales. Here we go. This is going to be the task. 
So loading, yes, we are loading. And you can tell how much shorter these are because normally this loads up perfectly fine. There we go. 24 bells. Boom, baby. We got it. I'm so excited. This is great. Yes. All right, let's get these dumped off. And we're going to roll in here. If you guys caught yesterday's video, this is exactly how we did this as well. And make sure you do not unload the bells on the trailer yet. Because right now it doesn't actually know that there's bells on it. Which is kind of what we want. You don't have the weight. You don't have the craziness. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. And these all will disappear, but they will sell nonetheless. So, what we want to do is pull up our help window so we know exactly what's going on. Let's unload bells here. There we go. And let's unload the trailer, which is just going to tip it back and drop the bells. And let's see how it goes about. These will disappear as soon as they hit. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about right there. Oh, you got to love it, man. You got to love it. Let's do that a couple more times. Boom, baby, we got it. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, let's bring this back down. A couple things that we need to sell, get rid of all that good stuff. Let's, um, you know what? We could probably do it from right here. Let's just turn it off for a second. Nice and quiet. Calm, quiet. Yeah. All right, let's jump in here. Garage, let's return that first and foremost. Let's go to owned vehicles and owned all items and stuff like that. Roll through. We got to get rid of the hybrid X extractor. We don't need that anymore. And this guy right here, the bell fork. We don't need that either. Boom. Well, let's get this back. Actually, you know what? Let's take this because I think we're going to need this truck. Are we? Mm, no. We need the American truck. There we go. That looks much better, especially for where we're about to head off to. Now, we've got one tractor that we're going to take over from this farm. And that is this guy right here. Ah, uh, yeah. The Case IH 7240 Magnum Pro. Yeah, this thing is sweet. Is that green in the back? I think that's green back there. Is that right? I think we've got a John Deere. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. We got the 6M. Yeah. We got the 6M. It is looking good. Wait, are we big? Yeah, we're a little off. Just just a hair. Not too bad. Not too bad. Just got to get it nice and straight. There we go. Perfect. Unload that. And we're going to get these guys taken over. Man, I'm so excited about this. I know I had said it, and we're going to do it. John Deere and Case will coincide on the same farm. You guys can get over it. <laughs> We're gonna make it happen. And of course, we got our black truck. Now, the black truck's gonna come back with us because we're gonna need it later on. We're gonna need it for buying stuff. Let's get this thing backed up, nice and easy. Got it. And then I'm pretty sure that bringing this forward's gonna scoot them, yes. That is correct. <laughs> is this how you do it? Gotta be, right? Oh! No. Bad things. All right, can we try this again, please? Without all the drama? No drama. It's a drama-free zone. <laughs> DFZ, drama-free zone, that's right. So we've got, again, the 6M. We got the old school Magnum. These are gonna be what start our farm for us. I don't know if we're gonna just go with these two, but we're definitely gonna start with those two right there. And welcome to Woodshire. Yeah, we're, oh, slow down. 
We got over here. All right. Everything is good. Everything's about the way we left it. It's just, God, stupid cars. Probably should have stopped, but the car in front of me didn't stop either. To be fair. Ooh, superior harvesting. Yeah, case IH. Let's see if we can pass this guy going up the hill. We are rolling in. We barely have any fields over here, though. I thought when I bought it, we would have more fields, but we have one. One field. We have two farms, which is sweet. All right, nice and easy. Let's pull in here. Don't want to destroy any crops or anything. Easy. Can we do it without doing any, any damage? Yeah, I think we can just fine. Just fine. There we go. So we guys think of our new farm. Well, we'll be our new farm soon. We've still got a little bit more work to do. Let's see. We've got a couple tractor bays right here. I feel like these will work just fine for these right here. Let's get this unattached. There we go. Bring this over. Kind of out of the way. Nice. Man, this is a really, really cool farm. I'm excited. I've got big plans for this. Fortunately, we've got a whole lot more work to do before we get over here. Parked up. That's good. There's one and two. Now, we will be bringing most equipment from, uh, from Mercury Farms over here. Raise this up a bit. There we go. We will be bringing most of the equipment over. Some stuff we will purchase here, uh, but we're going to try and bring over some stuff, maybe sell some stuff before we do. There we go. So we're not going to be hanging out here too long. Just enough to get in, bring our stuff by, and get moving. Here's our truck. Let's jump in. And let's head back over to Mercury Farms because we still have some work to do over there. While we're here, I was thinking it was a good idea to go check out our other farm. Let's swing this by real fast. Ooh. Actually, I'm starting to think maybe bringing this guy in here was a bad idea. Ooh. So I've been told this is a private drive only for us. Very cool, very cool. Hopefully we don't bottom out. Good. There's no way I'm making it in there. So let's walk around and check it out. Nice, nice. Got some smaller little storage areas. Good. Got a barn. Hey, barn. Can we get up here? Let's climb up here see what we got. Yeah. All kinds of good stuff. There's that. There's that. Oh, basketball. Yeah. You know we got to shoot some basketball. All right. We're going for big. Went too hard. Went too hard. <laughs> there's that. We got a field back here. All is good. All is good. Axle flow combines from Case IH. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. A little bit over here. Yep. Just a little bit extra area. And as far as I'm aware, we also have animals over here too. Let's see. We've got horses right here. And I believe up the hill a little bit, we've got some sheep as well. And that is a fact. Right there. There's our sheep. Very cool. Awesome. Well, let's head back over to Mercury Farms. we got some stuff to do over there. Again, we have some harvesting that needs to happen. Needs to happen very, very quickly. And we are home, baby. Yes, we are. Back on Mercury Farms. Gotta love it. Let's boom out. Now, I did bring the gold hopper with us. What I'm going to do is set this to the side. Just, you know, just to the side-ish. About right here is probably fine. There we go. Let's hop out and let's get in here. Challenger, ideal. My goodness, this thing is a monster and a half. I love it, I love it, I love it. We've got sunflowers to do. Now, <clears throat> for some reason, there was a, uh, a buy anything. Mine came out not too long ago that you cannot buy sunflowers from. Super confusing. I don't understand it. What I do understand, however, is this guy right here. Oh, we'll slow it down. We are very, very front heavy. Nice and easy. Behave. There we go. We are, well, extremely front heavy. <laughs> yeah, you can see the back wheels. Doesn't even begin to describe it. So what we've got to do basically is not slam on the brakes going forward because we we've got traction. 
But as soon as we hit the brakes, those back wheels just come off the ground. It's just a bit too much up there. Nonetheless, we could still make this happen. We could still do this just fine. But it's just a bit heavy on the front. As you guys can see, we've got a huge field right here of sunflowers. That's going to be awesome. We also have these fields right here. They're all ready to go with the exception of 29. 29 will be ready soon. We've got all this right here. This is barley. There's so much barley in that field. Goodness gracious. Nonetheless, let's see if we can get all of this unfolded. Boom, boom, boom. Man, this is a good looking piece of machinery right here. I'm not sure it gets much better good looking than that. Let's bring it up right here. We are going to hire a worker on this because if you're out of run through, it's going to go super. F oh man, those wheels aren't even on the ground. Just need to line it up. Nice and easy. Come on, you could do it. Hire a worker and boom. And it just takes off. I love it. Now it's going to be a bit of a chore to catch up to this guy because we've got that modded header which will go 15 miles per hour and so i'm not even sure that we're going to catch this guy before they get to the end of the field i mean we're going twice as fast as they are and it's still going to take us a minute to get down there oh yeah look he's just going oh come on go faster 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 must go faster must go faster we're not going to catch up are we by the end of this row we will not catch up nope no nah, we'll catch up we should have got a faster tractor is what we should have got nearly full grain tank i know i'm trying <laughs> let me catch you there we go unload now we're gonna get a whole lot of sunflowers off of this field and i'm pumped about that oh slow it down baby slow it down there you go now because this is so front heavy i am actually having to come through and do the turn for it here we go get all this unloaded it should give us uh yeah, not quite a trailer full, but it's got a lot, a whole lot. And there we go. That is it. But I tell you what, I do love the way this Challenger version looks. If you guys haven't got this new Ideal Combine yet, I don't even know what to tell you. Because this is the bee's knees. This is the real deal right here. Get that? Hire a worker. Send it on his way. This field ain't going to take no time to do. One thing's for sure, I'm definitely tired of driving that small tractor around. <laughs> we can really get some ground covered and really get some work done driving this guy around right here. Ah, uh, yeah. Also, something else that I found out. Check out the price for sunflowers right now. $2,700 per thousand liters. Um, yeah, guess what I'm going to be selling today? Sunflowers. Yeah, that's right, baby. Uh, I did dump the rest in the uh, in the grain bins that we've got, so I'm going to have to go back, unload that into this trailer. I think I'm going to do that as soon as we get down, or at least as soon as this guy completely finishes unloading their load, that's when I'm going to go do that. And then we just sell right there. That's it. Right there. Oh, gosh. This guy's killing me. Ooh. Any more in there? Nope. No more. You do your thing. I'm going to go over here and do my thing. Let's see. Roll up through here. I'm still trying to figure out this line right here. I think I just got a little too far over on that second, third pass. That's definitely a third pass. Wouldn't that be crazy if that was one full pass right there? My goodness. What's also crazy is that guy is flying like we're not even halfway up the field yet, and they are already on their way back making a return trip. Absolutely insane how fast that thing goes. Granted, we're only going like 35, 36 up that hill. We got a heavy load behind us, and it is about to get heavier. Here we go. I am determined to get down here before they end the row. Come on, go, 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 go. We're going to make it. Yes. That's what I'm talking about right there. Empty that out. Perfect. Now, I think because they're going to finish the row, they're going to... Yeah. Oh, not too far, though. Oh, goodness gracious. How much do they have left in here? Hopefully we fill this thing up. Actually, do I hope we fill it up or do I hope we not? Fill it up just enough. <laughs> there we go. There's our magic number. 52,195 
liters. Goodness gracious. That's a whole lot. We have got to get this thing over there somehow. We could go through and cut the fence. You know what? That's a good idea. Let's do that real quick. Because we've still got our chainsaw. As long as we can still do that, because we own this field, we own this area. So I think, uh, was it? Cut something right under in here. Just enough to kind of open it up. Just chop the top off. That's all we need to do. Just open it up. One more. Let's get this one right here. Boom, baby. Pow. So now we've got a nice opening. And we can pull right through. Good. Good, 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 good. <laughs> I'm not sure if that saved us any time or not. It'll save us time next time. But for now, that did it for us. I roll through here. And we're going to see exactly how much money we're going to make. I am going to turn on the help window so that I can see exactly when this gets full, when this gets empty. There's that. Tip side back. Tip side front. Let's unload that. How are we going to fare? $66,000 for that first run. And for the second, 77701 Not too shabby at all. I'm loving the money we're making on here and every penny that we make we're going to be able to take with us over to the next map and i'm so excited about that well guys that is going to be it for today i hope you've enjoyed if you did please drop a like no please subscribe if you have any questions drop them down in the comment section below I'll be happy to help you out hope you guys have a great day and we will see you later peace